Welcome. Welcome to our latest section on social media hacks for savvy business owners. Uh, today we're going to show you how you can use a social media platform, a management platform called Social Pilot to save you time and money in the long run. Now, we have written a post about this previously on our digitalmarketingcourses.com uh, website, which we will link to at the end of this video. Uh, but essentially, we love Social Pilot for a few reasons. One, because it's relatively inexpensive uh, when compared to other social media management platforms. And two, the ability to do what's in a self-branded post. So what it means is that instead of having to show um, you know, this post was scheduled, um, sent by Hootsuite or Buff or whatever, it will actually show the brand name of your own business. So people can actually sing and not realize that you've actually scheduled it. So it does have a lot of branding um, advantages over other social media management tools. So what we're going to do now is show you how to uh, create a social media um, management plan through Social Pilot. Now, just quickly, I'll just show you the plans that are available. As you can see, it's quite economical. It's obviously in US pricing, but um, it's got a great features and benefits. And we're really excited to announce that for any students who are enrolled in our digital marketing courses, whether it's the 10 week digital marketing superhero course, our one week taster course, or any of our other courses, you can actually trial the paid plans um, for 30 days instead of 14 days. So what do you need to do to get started? It's quite easy. All you need to do is click down where it says get started. For the purpose of this tutorial, I'll use the free version. You click get started. Once you've clicked on the get started button, you will be redirected to a new user registration page. Here you can either register the old, I guess the old fashioned way, entering all your details, or you can log in via Facebook, LinkedIn, or Twitter. Once you've uh, done this, you will most likely have to confirm um, information in your email address. And then once you've confirmed all your details, you'll be redirected to a dashboard. This is a dashboard for my digital marketing agency event to me. And as you can see here, it shows you your posting history and anything that you've done recently. So what you need to do in order to connect your account accounts is you need to click on where it says social accounts. After you've clicked on the social accounts or connect account button, you'll be redirected to a page that looks like this. This page shows you all the social media tools that can be connected with Social Pilot. In order to connect the relevant profile or page, you need to click on the social media tool and then click on click connect profile if it's a personal account or connect page for a business page. What happens then after you click that button, you'll be redirected to a page on that social media site, which will basically ask you if you authorize Social Pilot to connect to it. Once you've done that, you're ready to create your post. In order to create a post, all you need to do is scroll down to the left and you'll see the create post, uh, create post tab. Here is where you create it. So here you would do something along the lines of whatever you want it to be. So hi there, this is a test post. Make sure you include a hyperlink back to the relevant website. And then don't forget to consider what hashtags you want to include in the post. So remember that hashtags help you get your content across and help to cut through the clutter. So you don't wanna have every word as a hashtag, but your most relevant Hashtag. So for me, for example, uh, digital marketing would be a hashtag that I would want to um, want to use because hashtags make things public. Once you've written your post, you then decide on which account you want it to go out to. Then you can decide whether you want to share it now, schedule it, or add to the queue. So the queue was that thing when you link to accounts and it shows you um, particular times that it recommends for the post to go out. Now, if you need to ever change or delete a post before it goes out, you just click where it says manage post. And it will show you everything uh, that's coming out or has been um, published under delivered. Queued shows you what's coming up and delivered shows you what's been sent. 
you can also bulk schedule. So for example, if you've got a lot of content that you need to get out, you can do up to 500 records at one time and it will save you a lot of time. Now, there are a lot of advanced features that make Social Pilot quite, uh, quite unique, but we won't discuss that in this video. That will be for a later video. Now, Social Pilot does have amazing customer service, so you can contact them via message, uh, by leaving a message or by emailing them. Just remember, if you're using the free account, that there are some certain limitations. So if you do want to trial out the, the more formal paid accounts, remember that through digital marketing courses that any students will be able to trial the paid account for 30 days instead of 14. So there you go. Everything you need to know on how to manage your social media more effectively. We look forward to seeing you become digital marketing superheroes. Until next time.